nyingine viongozi ndani ya serikali ya Kenya kwanza wakiongozwa na Nai Bryce Rigathi Gashagwa wamefutilia mbali uwezekano wa Rais William Ruto kufanya majadiliano na kinara wa upinzani Raila Odinga viongozi hao wanasistiza Rais Ruto alichaguliwa kidemokrasia na kuhoji njama ya upinzani ya kushinikiza mazungumzo na serikali ni ndoto ambayo haitatimia wala kuruhusiwa kwa vivyote vile aidha wamekashifu vikali Odinga kwa maandamano hayo wakisema yanasambaratisha uchumi wa nji mbali na kuharibu na bali na uharibifu mkubwa wa mali samahani of this country are clear this is no longer demonstrations this is post election violence mugging theft robbery including robbery with violence those are felonies if they care to look at the penal code, the consequences are extremely heavy. Monday, the government of the Republic of Kenya will assert its authority in protecting life and property and upholding the rule of law. Tunataka kuambia wale wa Kenya ambao hawatosheki kura iliisha matokeo yalitangazwa We will say they will have vicarious liability and their political party ile pesa wangepata from political parties fund itolewe kwa ministry of roads to repair mabarabara yenye imengolewa na wale ambao wanangoa barabara hiyo mambo ya maandamano kile mtu alikuwa anaangalia katiba ukiangalia kipenge cha 37 kinaruhusu peaceful demonstration lakini tukiangalia vile vitendo ambazo zimetendeka for the last 3 weeks it is not peaceful demonstration, ndugu zangu. Goons have taken over, and now the idea of peaceful demonstration cannot be overemphasized. Kwa sababu, watu wengi ukiangalia kileo magazeti, people are in pain. People have been injured. Tunaomba radhi kwa mkanganyiko wa sauti katika habari hiyo.